Google's Gemini AI recently released the Nano Banana update that many are calling the best photo editor in the world. And I see endless potential for print on demand sellers. So in this video, I wanna show you a few ways that I plan on monetizing this leap forward in AI technology. Let's get right to it. So that's the Gemini logo and the Nano Banana enhancement only recently went live. Like I'm pretty sure in the last 24 hours or so, as of me recording this video. So it's really exciting to be on the cutting edge. Here's an example of the first thing I tried. I grabbed a picture of a product from Etsy that you see over here on the left-hand side. And I basically asked it to create a unique rendition of that design, inspired by that design, but unique. Make it unique, unique colors, unique uh, poses, etc., And make it with a transparent background that I can use on my own print-on-demand products. And it generated this image right here, which I was able to take to Printful. And just using it as an example, I went to uh, the travel mug with handle that Printful has available starting at $22.10. But if you have Printful growth, you can get the fulfillment starting at $18.48. And by the way, you can get Printful growth for free if you can reach, I think the threshold is like $12,000 in sales over a 12, 12 month period, which honestly is not that hard to do if you take advantage of the fact that you can integrate your Printful account with an Amazon store, an Etsy store, eBay store. If you do those three and you create quality products in high demand niches, you'll be there in no time. Also wanted to make you aware that Printful has a ton of mockups that you can generate by default, no extra um, premium membership needed or anything like that. So I love the mockup here behind me. And they've got a couple other really good ones like lifestyle mock-ups of these travel mugs specifically that I really liked um, if I wanted to sell these Halloween inspired dancing skeletons. The next thing I wanted to try is I took a selfie of my wife and I at a Thai festival and I said, replace the girl with Donald Trump. Let's see what happens. So that's our photo. And boom, it spit out this image. Now, one thing I noticed is that it tried to match Trump to her height. But I thought this could be a funny kind of like gag gift that you could offer on Etsy where personalization is allowed. Essentially, have somebody send you the image, pop it into Gemini, and say, hey, replace you know this person with, or just add Donald Trump to the photo as if we're taking a selfie. Uh, it's really good at following instructions. Then I took that photo and made it available on an iPhone case. And by the way, Printful has basically all the most recent iPhone models going back to iPhone 11 supported. If you wanted to sell cases, they also have three different types of cases. I know they have like a transparent one. They have the tough case. I forget what the third one is. Um, and they start at $10.73 with Printful growth. So you could sell them at $19.99 easily all day, plus charge a premium for personalization. And then just to be fair, I also said, switch the girl out for a photo of Barack Obama. So there I tagged both boxes, got the Democrat, and the Republican, there we go. And then I put it on a Samsung phone case, which has the exact same pricing as the iPhone uh, case. Next one, I thought there's a lot of potential with this one, guys. Colorizing old photos, old family photos, for instance. You know, I mean, anything that can tug on the heartstrings, if you're trying to sell on Etsy, and keep in mind, Printful has a catalog of hundreds of print-on-demand products that you could sell, so don't feel restricted. But I asked it to colorize the photo, it did a pretty incredible job if you ask me. I mean, look at that. I don't know if, you know, it would be crazy if they actually had some sort of record of what color people's clothes were back then on the day that this photo was taken. Uh, but that looks really good. And then you can sell that on a postcard, a greeting card all day. Um, you could put on a whole bunch of things, but the one that came to mind was like, you know, your family Christmas card maybe, and then grabbing a, a photo from, you know, grandma and grandpa back before they had color photographs or something. So I thought that was a great idea. And those start at $2.50 on Printful. Next up, I said, create a black and white pencil drawing sketch of this home. So shout out to my sister. She just bought a brand new house. And I was, you know, I got to get her a gift at some point, a home, uh, housewarming gift. Well, look at the quality of this sketch. Look at the side by side. Like it didn't just generate a random sketch of a home. It got this to a T. It even matched the trees. And it did it in a monotone design. It did it like a pencil sketch. So, I mean, I'm blown away by that one. And I was thinking, hey, you know, Christmas is going to be here before we know it because time is absolutely flying. How about something like this? You add the design to a Christmas ornament. They have ceramic ornaments here in Printful. They come in four different shapes as well. The circle, the heart, the star, and the snowflake. 
starting at $4.44 with Printful Growth, you could easily for a custom, for if you're offering not only custom photo, but then you do the um, alteration to it, you know, the customer doesn't have to know that you use AI. You could probably charge like $15 and make over $10 profit per sale. You know, obviously you're gonna pay some fees to Amazon or Etsy, but I love the idea here and ornaments are huge in Q4. Then I just use Printful's text tool in their designer to add the new home, January 1st, et cetera. So it took me an extra maybe 30 seconds max to add that text in. Um, didn't have to do it in Photoshop or anything like that. So very simple. I love simplicity. You know, time is money. Oh, another one. I grabbed another photo of a house and I said, create a watercolor painting of this home. And Gemini answered, uh, that is beautiful. I, I mean, maybe I queued it up for an easy one. Was it the, the photo that I chose? Did I just choose a good photo? Because the quality of the, you know, paint brush strokes in this rendition looks spot on. I mean, it looks realer than real. It even has like, can you guys tell it has the texture in the sky as well? Absolutely insane. And I was thinking, how about taking this and putting it on a jigsaw puzzle? This honestly might be what I do for my sister and her husband because I know they're both into puzzles. Might have to challenge them with the uh, 40 by 28 inch. Maybe I'll swing by her house, just take a couple like high res photos what do you guys think? Watercolor it and then order them a custom puzzle. I think that might be a really good idea. For the next one, I used myself as an example again, but I said, place me at Disney World with the big tower in the background and a beautiful dusk sky. And it spit this one out. And I was like, you know what? I'm at Disney World though. Shouldn't I be wearing a Mickey Mouse headband? And check that out. Then it generated this one from the uh, previous image that it had generated. So really cool that you can have it place you in different settings and then make alterations to the image. Like I didn't even try, but I probably could have said, hey, change my shirt color from black to Disney blue to match the tower behind me. And I, so check it out on the left-hand side there. I ran the prompt and it delivered. It changed the color of my shirt from black to blue and matched it. I love that. Now don't think that you only can offer this as a print on demand uh, product-based business. You can offer this as a gig on Craigslist, on Fiverr, on Etsy, you know, don't restrict yourself in how you can monetize the fact that you know this technology exists because I guarantee you most people do not and they will pay for it and some will pay a premium for it. So get out there, put yourself out there and monetize it. All right, one last one. I uploaded a headshot and I said, turn my face into a cartoonized logo. By the way, another skill set you could easily charge for on these services, but I wanna show you how I used this logo behind me. So I'm here in my Printful dashboard. If you're not already using Printful, I'll put my link in the description. You can literally start for free in about one minute. And I just dropped a video last week showing you how to launch a print-on-demand business on Printful in 2025 and beyond. I'll link to it in the YouTube cards right here and in the description, but go check that video out. It walks you through step-by-step. Step. Keep in mind, Printful has fulfilled almost 40,000 orders for me to date. So if anybody's an expert that can show you how to be successful with them, I would like to nominate myself uh, and I'm giving all that info out for free. Now I'm gonna go over here to product templates and I, my goal now is to create a product using the image that I just showed you from Gemini. So I'm gonna click create template and then I'm gonna look for business cards. So I'm gonna go to the search and I'm gonna type in business and select set of business cards. The next thing I need to do is upload my design which I've already done. So I've got the uh, face design right here. I'm gonna click it and I need to select the orientation of the card. Okay, it knew I wanted to default to vertical, perfect. The next thing that I'm gonna do is reposition this just a little bit off to the side. Then I'm gonna go to Printful's text tool over here on the sidebar, show you how easy this can be. So I click text, and then I'm just gonna select a text pairing from what they've already put together over here. So I'm gonna go with this font pairing right here, and I'm gonna go ahead and change the text. The top's gonna say Ryan's, and then the next one is going to say it's theoretical, right? HVAC repair. <laughs> How about something like that? Boom, just like that. We're good to go. And I think that looks like a pretty professional business card. I'm gonna click mock-up in the top right corner. Just make sure everything looks really good. I think it does. I can go back to design and then I would wanna go to the back side. So that was the front. Now we can do the back. 
by simply clicking back. And how about that guys? Now I've got the back of the card designed as well. And I think it looks pretty good. I was able to do that in a minute or less. The whole point I keep coming back to, it should be quick. It should be easy because time is money. Anything that you do, you don't want to be tethered to your business all day and night. That's why we outsource to Printful. Let them do the fulfillment and the design. Keep it simple. Leverage Gemini AI, leverage Printful's design tool and get it done with as low effort as possible so you can focus on scaling your business, making even more sales and even more money because that's why we're here, right? Anyways, guys, thank you for watching till the end. I'll link to Gemini in the description with the Nano Banana update as well as Printful so you can create your free account. Thank you for watching till the end and I'll see you at the next one.